but maybe this will be the angle that cracks the case. Back in 2014, WOWT 6 News' Mike McKnight reported on this bumbling burglar stealing an ATM at a pump and pantry in Sarpy County. At this point, investigators were working on tracking down the suspects of a string of ATM thefts that started in 2013. While the suspects were not always successful, like in this car wash at 113th and West Center Road, the spree would continue for three years until Friday. These, these individuals were very loyal to each other, making it extremely difficult on our end to develop information for us to proceed further. Friday, Omaha police announcing the arrest of eight people in connection to the crimes. At the center of the investigation, Omaha police detectives Chad Simmons and Ryan Templeton. The next piece would come and it leads you a little bit further down the road and the next piece and the next piece until eventually we made arrests. As the case developed, it became known to be widespread, requiring several agencies to work together across the region. And that's when OPD quickly learned there were other cases in the metro, like here in Bellevue with DJ's dugout off 23rd and Cornhusker. And the suspects kept working, striking here at 98th and Giles at Eddie's La Vista Mart, but still the suspects continued on their spree, hitting here at 120th and Dodge at the Russell Speeders car wash. And outside of Nebraska, police say they hit Kansas, Iowa, South Dakota, Missouri, Oklahoma, and Colorado. At the heart of it all, two Omaha police detectives that wouldn't give up and kept digging to make the arrests. It's been personally very satisfying to me to finally make these arrests, see these federal indictments come down. Um, you know, it's been a three-year investigation.